having a dope ass day. It's your boy Alex and I am back today with another reaction video for YES! I'm addicted and I just can't get enough. Yes! Some more Sabaton because I love this fucking band. Nobody cares. And this was also a comment on the Bismarck video. Almost 900 likes so it's obviously a song that a lot of you guys want me to react to so here we are reacting to it. The song is called To Hell and Back. If you want me to tell you about this song. No. I will go ahead and do that. This song is about Audie Murphy and if you don't know anything about him you're in the same boat as me. Let me tell you a little bit about him. Audie Murphy is the most decorated US soldier in World War II and there are simply too many stories about his deeds to even try to cover them in such a short text but among his fellow soldiers he was truly a hero and great inspiration. When he returned from the war he suffered heavily from PTSD and after a long time on medicines he finally locked himself in a motel for one week to cure his addiction to the drugs. After this he became a very famous movie star and even acted in the movie about himself that was titled To Hell and Back and was also the title of his book. So it sounds like a very interesting character. Part of the reason why I absolutely love Sabaton is because they make songs about history, about things that actually matter in today's day and age. I have never heard a bad Sabaton song so really stoked to see what's gonna happen today. Link to the original video will be down below in the description. While you're down there, there is the link to the new Richard the Llama shirts, and if you want one of those shirts, and you buy one of those shirts, it will automatically enter you into the chance to win a box full of hundreds of dollars worth of metal stuff. Sorry I'm getting worked up, I'm eating cookies still for breakfast, but yeah, here's the box filled with a bunch of DVDs and CDs and cool stuff for you guys. That being said, let's get it. All the links down below in the description. Sabaton to hell and back! This is the reason why you shouldn't be eating chocolate chip cookies and coffee in the morning for breakfast, because you'll end up doing some weird energetic stuff that you don't normally do! <sighs> okay, now I needed that. Wow. That's fucking crazy, dude. Back then, PTSD was called shell shock. A little interesting factoid for you. did not expect this in the slightest. So this makes me feel a little interesting too because the song is so cool. It makes me smile and makes me happy, but then it goes to flashes of this man experiencing such pain and sorrow in the hotel room or wherever he is and it's it's sad. So it's like conflicting emotions in the song, which is really interesting honestly. And of the 15th, a man of can do. Friends fall around him, yet he came through. Let them fall face down if they must die. Making it easier to say goodbye Right, our white light If there be any glory in war Let it rest what? on them like him Glory oh. to hell and came back Going to 
I've noticed about Sabaton is their guitar solos are actually pretty short. It makes me want more, and I think that there's something to that. A lot of times in music, guitar solos are very long, but this, the length of it, it makes me want more, so that's really interesting. Very interesting tactic that they did. I don't know if that was deliberate or not. Quite some time after the war, Adi locked himself into a motel room for seven days to get rid of his addiction to the drugs and was finally able to return to normal life. Lieutenant Murphy received every military combat award for valor available from the U.S. Army. Medal of Honor, Distinguished Service, Cross, Silver Star, Legion of Merit, Bronze Star, Purple Heart, Good Conduct, Presidential Unit, Citation, American Campaign, a bunch of other stuff that I can't read because I don't read fast enough. Wow. That was a fucking fantastic song. That sounded like a little bit like some folk metal or some Camelot time stuff. Like, honestly a really cool group too because I don't know what to expect from them. And the one thing that I know is quality. I know that they're gonna produce a quality product but I don't know what it's gonna sound like and that's the fun part about this. That's why Sabaton has quickly become one of my favorite bands that I've listened to on this channel and it's so fun to watch them play together because you can tell that they're having a good time. You get this happiness, this elation from the song but this intensity and this dreariness from the subject matter of it. So it's this conflicting emotion like the highs and lows of it smacked into one song and that's what Sabaton is and that's the type of emotion and energy that they do such a good job of capturing so but that's where you guys come in drop some comments down below let me know what you think about this on this group this video in general that is all I got for you today so keep smiling keep being yourself don't let anybody throw shade at you I will see you guys tomorrow this motherfucking facto yeah peace